Alright, hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and today we're going to be playing some more The Alchemist Code. Now, there are a few events here. I already tried out um, the extra dungeon for our newest character, or our newest free character. And I also have this inside of my bag. I don't know what stats are on it, but I honestly do want to see. It's pretty much a sweet extra dungeon. That's what it was. Oh... So you got luck, HP, and evasion rate. So that would be good on some characters that has some really good evasion. Alright. Now we also do have a... Um, have like this little tutorial thing we can go through. But first things first, we do have some new characters that have a few new classes. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get anything good out of that, but... We're going to do a summoning towards the end of the video. Um, as of right now, we're not doing that at the start because we got to pretty much earn it. So, here are the rewards for doing all these tutorials. Let's go ahead and do the training stuff. Then we'll get into the extra dungeon for here. The extra dungeon is not really all that hard. I did try it just to see if I wanted to do it this video or if I could do it this video. It was actually not all that difficult. Do I need anything? Okay, just defeat all foes. Yeah. Tanami wa. So this is this is pretty much a new dungeon for people who just finished the tutorial. So I'm pretty sure this is gonna be a permanent thing. Okay. Yeah, I don't have to do anything here. So, this place does give us apples. It's only the medium ones, though. Okay, and he tells you about it at the end. Okay. That, that approach most other games would take. Most of the time they would like just put arrows and tell you where to go instead of actually going into a mission then finishing the mission then them explaining everything to you. I think it would be better if they would have done it the way others do it. Because people are more because there's a lot of people who are more visual learners than, you know, telling. Alright. Now we're going to be talking about equipment. Alright, equipment next. But yeah, we'll. I think we'll have enough time to do the whole sweet extra event. Alright. Now there's not gonna be anything like really powerful in here. I'm just interested in the dialogue. Yeah, 
All right. Oh yeah, I did forget to tell you guys she's at level 77 at the moment. I'm almost having her to level 85. It's just taking way longer than I expected just because the sh her shards drop so rarely. And as you guys can see, my energy is low today just because I was farming yesterday. It's actually ridiculous how low her shard chance is. This is why I hate uh, clutter, clutter loot. When they sort of just added in a whole bunch of random loot with the shards you're supposed to get for the free unit. I guess you do have to work for the free unit, you know? But still, lots and lots of suffering through that. <laughs> Alright. And that's pretty much done. Oh yeah, there's two games that released today. I forgot about that. And I'm gonna have to work on those, like... Probably next week? More than likely next week. Oh, Logi shards. Okay. I can use more of his shards. I, I don't think I've gotten him to 85. I forgot all about that. So we got two more. Say, I wanted to see how they're gonna approach this. Alright, she's not gonna move. Alright, the team is approaching it pretty well. Oh, wait, there's somebody else alive? Oh, okay, well then, sniped through the wall. <laughs> I didn't even notice that guy. I don't know if it was me, we probably would have still been sitting here for a while. No worries, you're already max job right now. <laughs> so I don't really need to change you. Alright, this is the last one. Check it out. Then we can do a summon afterwards. Thank God, we're almost done. <laughs> To be honest, I don't know any of the new characters that I actually want to go for. I guess I'll just be happy with any of them. <laughs> okay. I actually like watching the AI sometimes just because they kind of come up with different strategies that I normally wouldn't think of. Sometimes. Sometimes they do some weird stuff. 
Like some stuff you wouldn't do. Mostly stuff you wouldn't do. But sometimes they can do unique things. Like me, I sometimes I wouldn't think about using um, Shockwave, which I need to use like way more often. I just keep forgetting about it. Okay, I'm not covering anything. So this only takes like 10 minutes. Well, probably less than 10 minutes if you're not reading the dialogue. Which most people won't. This is kind of why I say they should have took a different approach at that because most people won't be reading dialogue. All right, we're done. So we got a little bit of AP to spare. And plus, that's a lot of XP just to level us up to. There we go. Oh yeah, called uh, Scarlet Flame is also back, which is pretty much an old event for um, Chloe's sword. So if you guys have not max out Chloe's sword or want another one Devin is here well actually I don't think you can get another one well we can finish the sword let's just say that <laughs> let's go ahead and do the summoning I'm excited all right hope for our oh we're downloading so that means we got something new Something we haven't touched before. Oh, and it's yellow. Come on, red. There we go. What is it? Alright, we got one red. Oh, okay. I have no problem with that. Alright, who's this gonna be? Oh, I gotta click that. Alright. Not a big fan of him, but I'll still use him. My goal's almost done. Alright. I have no problem with that summon, to be honest. Because I've actually been looking forward to uh, getting her. Where is she? Oh, I'll probably just pass her. Since mine's is rarity set. There she is. Alright, so Ninja is second. That's going to be fun to get to. Yeah, I do have shards for her just because of the Monday, well, one of the Monday events. I can actually get her to Ninja. Question is, do I want to? Well, I have no other light units. <laughs> so I might as well, to be honest. Alright. Ninjutsu. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm wanting to use more often. Because I remember in one of the events that, that was like really strong. Okay. So we're done with that. Uh, let's go ahead and collect some of this stuff. And we're going to go do the sweet extra dungeon. See if we can get no deaths. Or see if we can do it easier. So the thing with this is that the most threat are the units in the back. Which are pretty much the Black Knights. Pretty sure that's what they're called. 
They're like really strong. Um, actually, I should keep her in and I should take you out. So pretty much everything you have to do is go in with less than four units. Um, use less than five items and no continues. No continues was actually pretty easy. I have no complaints with that. Hold on, let's see if I want to take in somebody else. I might remove her then. Wait, hold up. I'll check and see if this teammate has everything maxed out. Okay. Making sure, because most of the time people would not have anything maxed out, which would be quite troublesome most of the time. So these guys are the huge threat for multiple reasons. Each kill adds on to one of their abilities. So the best course of action is just to ignore them. But it's kind of impossible if you have characters that can counter in one shot. So kill these guys straight up the bat before they get their ability. Then... It's just easy selling from there. All right, some defense up here. stop that from happening. I know I'm gonna regret it. I'm gonna take a pretty much a decent amount of damage, but I wanna stop that. Let's see you just sold on this guy. You guys will see the attack I'm talking about. There it is. Each quartz equals bonus damage. Now that he got his out of the way. And boom, way more damage. Like it's possible with four people. You just, yeah, you just gotta be a little bit more smarter about it. Not like I am right now. Because I did kind of auto into this, which was pretty annoying. Now, you don't really have to worry about them. They literally only do like one damage. Now this is probably a bad choice. Probably shouldn't do that. But then again, it would probably still be the same outcome no matter what. Because I don't think I can actually uh, capitalize off that. Which is actually unfortunate. I'm still... I'm thinking that he's probably going to hit me for at least 60. That's going to kill me. Oh. 400 is not half bad. I do want to go down there and heal. But. Just to get a little bit of extra damage on both of them.
yeah, he's going to do it no matter what. Alright, so that's good. That's good to know. Alright, let's restart this and make sure that I'm not in auto. Because that's what really screwed me over. I was... I did not want to kill that guy. At the start. Take this off. Alright. Here we take it in. I guess you would be the best choice, wouldn't you? But yeah, that's my bad for forgetting auto is still on. I may want to kill her too because she's she's kind of debuffing everyone Which one costs the most? Uh, well, yeah, that would cost less, wouldn't it? The only problem is fire and wind there. Wish I had another water, but I don't. We're just gonna use this. As long as we get rid of her. Let's see if that's a better choice. Um, how much damage is this guy doing? Wow, he's not doing a whole lot. But I guess that's better than anything, huh? Maybe I should wait until I get closer. That could also be a choice. charging. That's what I wanted to avoid. Thanks, buddy. Now you can't avoid all of them, unfortunately. Alright, let's help him out with a little bit of damage there. Yep, this is gonna hurt. Just because that one guy had died. You know what? I'm gonna use you as more of a recovery. Okay, just making sure. Alright, strong would do fine. Making sure I'm not overhealing. Actually, hold up. Can I? No! I could have, though. I could have. That sucks. I can't even do this either. Wow, that. That sucks. As long as I get out one, I guess. God, he's gonna kill him. Of course. Yep, Chris. Hey, can you go up here? Okay, that's another thing I hate. Go right here, thank you. 
Now I'm pretty sure I can do this. Sweet. Pretty sure I could do the same thing on our dude. Hopefully Shayna kinda gets ahead of him. Ooh, nope. That's gonna hurt. He's dead. Well, I pretty much don't have to worry about it. As long as I uh, complete this, I'm good. Oh, come on. So much HP on this guy. Yeah, that's not good. No, don't worry about them. Um... Yeah, none of this is going to do anything. If you guys are wondering if they take effects, they don't. See? So that's kind of a downfall to this place. And plus, they only use that skill as well, if you guys are also curious about that. But he should be dead now. Those are only three threats on the map. Um, there are two more um, Dark Knights that pop up, which are the the Vampire and what's your face? I'm pretty sure you guys will see her soon. Because they show up after quite a while. Not the easiest place, is it? Well, not the easiest place for me at the moment. Well, I need to get rid of you. Because you did do some decent damage. These guys, they don't really do a whole bunch. Alright, there they are. These two pop up over here. So I want to get away from them. They travel three. So I should be good here. The only person who has the range attack is a little vampire friend over here. I'm actually going to do this so I can take him out. Good thing she goes first. As you, as you can see, you still have a chance of just getting one shard from this place. Which is, like, really terrible. But you still get some pretty decent items for here. Alright, I have enough to just take out both of them. Pretty easy, pretty straightforward. And I pretty much beat it with four. As long as it's finished. <laughs> oh wait, hold up. I almost... Mm, almost screwed up there. Yeah, I don't think I can hit you. Oh no, you're out of my range. Not anymore, I'm just gonna pierce you. Just for the fun of it. Alright, that's out of the way. <laughs> and that's everything. The most annoying thing is going to be getting all of these. That, that's going to be fun. <laughs> hmm. Alright, hold up. I gotta see what is Lydia at right now. Hey, I don't have Cryomancer at the moment. And I'm not using my rainbows just for that. I don't think I'll just collect her tokens and just go on from there. Uh, what do you need for her tokens? You need to finish this 10 times just to get all her tokens. 
So, get started. I think it's a lot easier once you finish the whole four, you can just use all of your units at that point. You just pretty much have no issue from that point on. So, yeah. Alright guys, that about wraps it up for our video. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next one. Till then, peace out. It's gonna get better real soon. Don't let anyone tell you what you should do. I got a clear view. We're gonna make it soon. Just keep pushing through. Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Just keep pushing through. Cause what you got to lose?